Hi everybody and welcome back to episode 14 of Ages Place in Valheim here. So, in the previous episode we scouted all the way to the boss. We found a few burial chambers, there's quite a bit of copper in this area as well which I didn't mark out. And yeah, we are going to do a little bit of a base upgrade. Uh, things are getting a little bit tight in the base. So we got to fix that. We did manage to get ourselves a decent amount of wood. I even needed to separate my wood and stone around. So, yeah, with that, let's get under some building. So we've also got our little blast furnaces here. We need to make a little bit of a better place for our beehive. Having them out in the open like that is not safe. And we do have the hoe to make our ground a bit more level. I don't know how big I'm going to make this this part yet. But oh, that looks decent. So this is pretty much going to be our little storeroom. Just clear these rocks away. So, because I did that, we don't need to lift the ground up. We can just make it flat. In any place that we find, we're a little bit on the on the ground side, like that. We can just smooth out. Okay, let's grab a hoe because I'm starting to lose track of where we're working. A little bit of ground convincing is needed. There we go. Yeah, it's fine. Okay, I wouldn't mind one more row here. Okay, so we do we'll need to strengthen this just a little bit. Because I want to make this almost a two story. Yeah, this will pretty much be our entrance. So what we're going to do here. Like that. We're just doing this to put a bit of strength to the structure, because the higher you go... Uh, things start getting a little bit wonky. It's not quite the word, but... Okay, let's go grab some more wood.
Okay. Uh, we don't have the big doors yet. That's a bit of a pity. Wouldn't have minded them. So we're just going to close off this side then. Like that. Yes, now we're just going to go like so. Try very hard to get them to snap. Actually, I want to use the smaller one. No, we do have the big doors. Never mind. Okay, I'm not going to change this because I need it again. Make sure that that's flat this time. Okay, and this one needs to go over here. Oh, we've run out of wood. No problem. So the reason I wanted the big doors, the cart will fit through there. to create a bit of a seeding gap there. And just to finish off the aesthetic. Boom. Okay, I did say I wanted the less slantier roof, so I think it's this one. Yeah, that one. It's just a matter of connecting the pieces together. This is why I brought all that extra wood over. And also why I didn't cover up this area properly because I want to make it look cool. Let's go like that. That. And just to keep the flow, we're going to go boom. Boom. And then we just need to c close up the middle. Nice, now we've got ourselves a little storeroom, which we can stop putting all that stuff over here. Get a bit more wood. We're going to start here. Yeah, 
let's go this way. Then we get the half rules, which we've got to manually snap into place. Like so. And same procedure again, but this one should snap eat. Oh, okay. See, I could have gone just a little bit higher, and it would be much more easier. An invalid placement it was there just a second ago. Okay, let's remove the chest. It will work then. Everything is not sticking out. Yeah, it's fine. Put the chest back in there. Do I have enough? No, nope, and you get a little bit more wood. Let's eat some food. Let me get ourselves some charcoal here. Don't need that much. I think we only need a, let's say 20. Hold my food for me. What's the better? I'll forget that there's food in there. Okay. I want them more or less the same place, but because it's now a little bit darker. There we go. Okay, let's go have a nap. Just to skip the dark time. Come on, get into my own house. Log rolling in. Okay, so we we brought the charcoal for the signs. We just do it like that. I don't know if it's facing the right way now. Yeah, now it's facing the right way. There we go. Actually, I want to make these a little bit more over, like so. For the very reason. Same with that one. They're not sticking out, are they? Yeah, so I want to make those just a little bit over. Oops, wrong button. So that I'm able to access the chest without too much hassle.
Okay. So. Seeds. Cooked. Raw. Wood. Stone. Uh, let me say heads. Uh, let's make this one hide. Uh, cores, even though we've only got one core. And gold for the moment. Grab all our food, grab all the annoying heads. So we've got all our cooked food here. All our raw food. All the annoying heads that we keep picking up. Technically those are raw. Uh, I actually don't know what to do with the amber, to be honest. Put the extra wood in there. See, I could have done it in here, right? I could have. But... We're going to kit this area out just a little bit better. We have another chest of these here. Yeah, we'll come back for that. And what have we got in our... I should have made one called weapons, but we'll put weapons in the other chest. So these are all the seeds. We do have one for gold, specifically for gold. And uh, let's make golden resin. Yeah, we're going to make one specifically for the... You can go in there for the moment. We're going to leave our weapons in the main house. That one. And we can leave our amber in there too. Like I said, I don't know what to even use the amber for. Never had a full on use for it. Now you're going to ask me, Edge, why are you taking all your valuable materials away from your crafting station? I'm not going to ask you to be doing that. The basic, like, card and that type of thing, I am going to leave here. But I'm not going to leave it all here. Okay. Uh, let's leave the gold here too. Not that that makes any difference to my carry weight, but... Yeah, now I'm going to still leave the, the main stuff there by the benches. But the bulk is going to sit in this place. Uh, 
just want to replenish my stamina. Uh, that falls under heads. Because technically it's a trophy. Yeah, we're not going to use this one. We change this to flint. Stone. Okay, with that, we've now got ourselves a little barn, safe and secure. We did run out of wood for our fire, though, but that's fine. For the, because I said to you we're going to make a kitchen, but. I'm still going to do that. I just need a repair. So, like, these aren't going to be too happy that there's now a base right next to them. Oh, they are still happy. If they're happy, I'm happy. Okay, we don't need to carry so much honey on us, though. Honey can go into the cooked one, because you pretty much eat as is. Uh, let's grab some more wood. We're not going to need so much stone, but let's grab 20 stone. Oops. 20 stone. Come on, ages. 20 stone. Okay. Uh, we're going to make a little fire right here okay so we need So all I have to do when it comes to cooking, I just got to stand here. I know these aren't exactly straight, but they don't need to be. There we go. Because what happened last time was I had so much meat and stuff to cook. I wasn't able to do all of it. We will be changing one of those to the cauldron. I just don't have enough tin for the cauldron right yet. But we will go get more tin and stuff in the next one. And with that, we now have a little shed for our main storage. We now got a little fireplace going, for cooking all our food. And I'm going to see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. And I hope you guys had a great time. And 
I don't think we're quite ready yet, but we may do another copper run. We'll go to that one we'll to just finish off that. See if we can get some more tin. And yeah, we'll see you guys in the next video. There's no official plan as yet. I'll think of one. <laughs> but we do need to start looking around and hopefully get ready to build our bigger ship. So that we can leave this island. Okay, everybody. Have fun.